Hey, look who it is. What's it been like five months? How you doing? Oh, what up? We still doing this? Yeah. Oh. Anyone else feel like the people from the district have been more annoying than usual? They're not all bad. I think they're cool. Uh, I actually like them this year. Shocking. Good morning, Abby Evelyn Jean. Girl, this development day has me developing a migraine. Let me have one of those aspirins, please. It's a sleeping pill. Wake me if there's a fire, a tornado, or a volcanic eruption. No comment about Gregory being F-O-I-N foin. No. New and improved models. Same old engines. These people aren't going to change a blessed thing, except how many bodies are in the room. And we'll see you around. A little early for this, no? For Christmas, maybe. To watch you lift heavy stuff in that shirt, never. This thing. Well, it is husband material. <laughs> Speaking of which, did you hear about Mr. Morton? What? He eloped over the summer. <gasps> Vegas? Hershey Park. Classy. Mm. Wow. You approve of that. But I bring up marriage and I get a <laughs> Yeah, yeah, all right. You just concentrate on getting that mini fridge next to an outlet. Boyfriend brings it in the room. A husband sets it near an outlet. Well, a booty call will put it down wherever I want him to, so don't make me go find one. <laughs> <laughs> Feels forced. But Chris is sending you signals. He's just joking. You know how men joke about that stuff all the time? No, I do not. I do not know of one man who would ask his girlfriend's friend for her correct ring size as a joke. He's probably like getting me a Super Bowl replica ring or something. Great news, everyone. There are no more free periods. Instead, everyone will be volunteering for lunch duty, hall monitoring, library management, etc. at all times. Well, at least we can still enjoy our lunches. Oh, and no more off-campus lunches. It's against policy. She must be stopped. Yeah, the library to librarian ratio is troubling, but nothing we can't fix. <laughs> Listen, speaking of, could you look into getting a McFlurry machine for my classroom? Because the McFlurry machine to classroom ratio, that's, that's also way off. <laughs> we can't do that. <laughs> Typical. Break it up, slackers. Yeah, I'm talking to you, Mrs. Miller, Miss Shaminti, ponytail guy. Yeah, that's right. I got cameras all over this place. Just to make sure we're always working to make Abbott a brighter place. Well, we made a plan to solve this Ava problem. We need to, like, reset her. We looked for a button. There wasn't one. So we decided to tempt her with things we know she loves. First, money. Oh. We sent Jacob in looking incredibly scammable. Second, her love of skipping work. In this case, for an usher show. <sighs> Nothing has worked so far, so now we're pulling out the big guns. Ready? No. Oh, come on. We cannot stand any more of this new Ava. And unfortunately, you are a very powerful tool. Tool? You're literally objectifying me. Objects don't talk. Bro, rub a sleeve and tastefully welcome her to the gun show. And lean against the door frame. You know how. OK, look. We need old Ava back. Mm -hmm. Well, she's dead and gone. I lead now. I communicate. I haven't listened to the city girls in months. This is who I am now. Well, I guess this is just life now. If Gregory's arms didn't work, nothing will. Ava, you're needed in the gym. Yeah, there's a bunch of teachers in there saying Princeton's better than Harvard. Oh, hell no! Okay, we have like two minutes, so can you please fill us in on the rest of this genius plan? We have our free periods back now. Yes! Good morning, everyone. We are so excited. And let me just tell you.